What's up guys, today we are going over a set of leaked Samsung Galaxy Note 10 specifications that might have just spilled the beans. We are still reeling from the release of the Galaxy S10 and the SM Plus, not to mention the S10e, but it's time to start talking about the Galaxy Note 10 immediately. As I mentioned in my last video that we are still several months away from an official reveal of a Galaxy Note 10 and even further still from the release date if Samsung follows their own schedule pattern. And yeah guys, this is the first ever specification leak of the Samsung Galaxy Note 10. So first of all, let's talk about the display. The Samsung Galaxy Note 10 will apparently bring forth a display that looks a whole lot like that of the Galaxy S10 Plus but on an ever so slightly larger scale. Not to be beaten by Apple's efforts to deliver maximum display power. The Galaxy Note 10 may come with a 6.6 .6 or 6.66 inch Super AMOLED touchscreen with 16M colors and an over 89% screen to body ratio. This device will likely have a display display density of approximately 505 pixels per inch given its 1440 multiplier 3040 pixel display and approximately 6.66 inch display. It will be interesting to see if Samsung uses the same display panel here as it will with the Galaxy S10 5G, a device with a 6.7 inch display with the same 1440 multiplier 3040 pixel resolution. At this time, it's not clear which processor will be used in the Galaxy Note 10. It would seem that placeholders include the same SSDs are present in the S10 but that still may well be true. With the Qualcomm Snapdragon 855 and Adreno 640, if that's what the Note users, they will still need the separate Snapdragon X50 or X55 modem for 5G connectivity. Cameras on the back of the Galaxy Note 10 are looking likely to match those of the incoming Galaxy SM 5G. That means the same 12-12-16 TOF combo we have seen rumored previously. So the first one is 12 megapixel with f1.5 aperture and 26mm lens with optical image stabilization 12 pixel PDAF. Second one is 12 megapixel with f2.4 aperture and 52 mm lens with optical image stabilization, focus, and 2x optical zoom. Third one is 16 megapixel with f2.2 aperture and 12 mm lens. And the fourth one is TOF 3D scanner camera. This device will also have an innovative new Samsung S Pen in its holster. This device will make use of every feature delivered with the Galaxy Note 10, plus more, bringing Bluetooth once again, this time with a considered camera. It's unlikely the long rumored and patented by Samsung camera and stylus will be delivered this year given the state of the display tech but you never know. What's more likely is that Samsung will skip over the S Pen based camera and slide side camera under the display for 2020 when they begin delivering semi-transparent display. Those displays won't need a notch or a hole, they will just be one big panel free and clear. So if we talk about front cameras, we are still expecting a pair of cameras on the front of the Galaxy Note 10 not unlike those that come with the Galaxy S10 Plus. That means a 10 megapixel camera with f1.9 aperture and a 26mm wide lens as well as an 8 megapixel camera with f2.2 aperture with 22mm lens, used primarily as a depth sensor. The Galaxy Note 10 will likely to be revealed in early August with a tentative scheduled date for Thursday, August 8, 2019. That date then likely set the full Galaxy Note 10 release date on August 23rd, 2019 inside the USA, parts of the Europe and the parts of Asia. Given the price of the Galaxy S10 and friends, we are expecting slight increase in prices for the Galaxy Note 10. So yeah, that's it for today. Now what's your thoughts on this? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below and yeah. Smash the subscribe button and press the bell icon for more latest news and as always, I will catch you tomorrow in the next one. Peace out.